Hello students. Today we are going to learn about centrifugal force and centripetal force. Centrifugal and centripetal centripetal force. Centrifugal and centripetal force. What is centripetal force and centrifugal force? Before we to learn this one, we will know about the centrifugal acceleration. Acceleration. Suppose a body moving in a circle, whose center is O, then a body moves from A to B, it displaces from A to B with velocity v with velocity v at the a and the radius of the circular path is let's radius of the circular path is r then angle at the center angular displacement is theta angular displacement is theta then Velocity at a point B. This also V. It is a tangential velocity to the circle. So now, if you observe this triangle, which triangle? If I take a, this triangle, O A B, whose angle between the two. Radius vector is theta. Then, if we join these two, this one B no, you have to write V bar V bar. These two vectors, these two vectors, that two vectors also forms same angle. These two vectors also forms same angle theta only. So these two triangles are similar triangles. So this is a change in velocity. This is a displacement delta s. Okay, these two are similar triangles. Now compare the <coughs> similar sides. So if we take, it means your a comma b will come. This side by this delta b by delta s is equal to. So b bar by R, V bar by R. So now, send delta S that side, delta V bar is equal to delta V by R into delta S. Divide both sides by delta T. So delta V bar by delta T is equal to V bar by R into delta S by delta T. So now observe here. Delta V by delta T. It is nothing but acceleration. Rate of change of velocity, acceleration. So this is delta S by delta V. It is a delta S by delta T. It is a velocity. This is acceleration. That is velocity. So now this one becomes acceleration is equal to V bar by R to V bar. This is acceleration is equal to V square by R. What is this? Acceleration acting toward the center of the circular motion. Acceleration acting toward the center of the circular motion. So, if a planet is revolving around any planet, or moon is revolving around the Earth, or Earth is revolving around the Sun, this is a centripetal, centripetal acceleration acting toward the center, toward the Sun, Earth is revolving around the Sun, the angulation acting toward the Sun. It is centripetal angulation. Centripetal angulation. Centripetal angulation. So, centripetal angulation we named as CP. Centripetal angulation how much? V square by R. V bar square by R. Okay. So, if the centripetal angulation is acting toward the center, 
and centrifugal agitation also equal and opposite acting at that point. Then only it can revolve in the circular orbit or elliptical orbit. So centrifugal agitation, centrifugal agitation also same will get, same but in opposite direction, but in opposite direction. This is in this direction, this is in this direction. Directions are different. So V square by R will come. Then what is the centripetal force or centrifugal force? So both are same but opposite in direction. So if you take a centripetal force, m into centripetal acceleration. So m v bar square by r. So centripetal force. Centrifugal force, centrifugal force is equal to m into centrifugal acceleration. That is m into v bar square by r. Both are same but in opposite direction. Okay, clear? No, no. Dear students, these are the paper balls. So if you leave like this, it will pass down due to gravitational force. Now I am taking one drilling machine, this arrangement with a waste bottle and keeping all these paper balls in it. Now carefully observe, this cannot pass down due to anti delta and Papers are not falling down. Be careful of those. Papers are not falling down. So I stop the rotating, it will fall. See? So now, if you throw these balls, then also they will take these balls inside. Carefully observe. Throw balls. Throw balls again. Throw balls again. This ball will fall down. See, all balls are fall down. So, due to anti gravity, why this anti gravity occurs? Due to centrifugal force. Centrifugal force throws the ball to attack this wall and make it stand, stick to this wall. That way, it is standing there. That way, it is standing there. Due to centrifugal force. Due to centrifugal force.